hello and welcome back to my channel so in this video i'm going to show you how you can get free intraday options data for more than four years directly into python uh, using uh, the api so the api contains all the data you don't have to save any files or download any files you can directly enter the date and name of the symbol and directly you will be getting uh, all the data and this data can be used for backtesting, for visualization, for uh, any purpose that you need. So this is the website that I have created, historical.maddicalgos.com. And over here, if you can see, like this is just the demo video. We'll, I'll be updating this video. After, I'll be changing it after recording the current video. All right. So uh, basically, this is the website and I've given the entire documentation for Python and exactly how you can directly uh, get the data into into your system all right so first of all before uh, we begin we first need to create an account on this website so i'll just go and click on create an account okay so yeah i'll be using this email id okay so this email id actually is uh, registered already but like I'll just show you, I've kept my username as Neeraj and I've kept email ID as this. And if I just click on the register, okay, it will show me that the account already exists. But uh, if you have, if you are a new user, uh, this will show you that your account has been created and your password will be sent to you on your email ID directly. And once you receive your password, you'll be able to use the API. So uh, let's go and install the API into into the like, let's go and install this library and I'll show you how to uh, get the fetch the data directly. So first of all, let's open the command prompt. Okay, we need to uh, first install this library called Matic Algos. So for doing that, you need to uh, like I am using Anaconda. So I'll, I've created a, an environment called Quant. So let me just activate that. If you are using directly Python or if you're using any other text editor, please follow that process. So once I have activated uh, the Quant uh, environment of, uh, of Anaconda, I need to go and install this library. So I'll just in copy it and paste it on the command prompt. So let me just paste it over here and we need to run this. So I've all run this. So I've already installed this library. So it will say that requirement is satisfied. Uh, once uh, once uh, you have done this, if there is any upgrade in the library, you need to just say pip install matic algos dash dash upgrade or you can just uninstall and reinstall the library. So there is no issue into that. Once the library is installed, you need to open your text editor. So I'm using spider over here. If you're using any other text editor, please uh, open that and we need to start coding. Okay, so from matic algos, we just need to copy paste this code and I'll enter my email ID over here. Okay, so right now I have entered this email ID. So after doing that, if you have forgotten your password, then you need to enter this code called ma.reset password. So right now I know the password as I have recently created my account and it is in, in my email itself. So I'll just use that password right, right now. But if you forget your password, you can uh, directly reset it using the code only. So once that is done, uh, that is done, we need to go and log in into our account. So this is ma.login and we need to enter the password over here. So whatever this number uh, is sent on your email ID, just use that and you will be able to log in into your account. So let me just run uh, this line. Okay, so we have uh, logged in into our account. So once we have logged in, uh, we need to fetch the data. So fe for fetching the data, the step is very easy. You just need to copy this line called get uh, under get data and paste it over here. First of all, we need to import date time 
because uh, the date input should be in date time format otherwise you won't be able to fetch any data and uh, if you are using date time dot date time then it won't be allowed you must use date time dot date date format only okay so uh, i'll run this line and let's fetch some data so it will take some time and we have fetched the data successfully so if you can see uh, in this uh, section over here all the symbols are symbol is visible in the in this table itself you'll